late 50s into the early 60s, they destroyed the whole business climate of black America in Pittsburgh. Okay. And then they went in with the Civic Arena and they said revenue was gonna follow them, follow the, um, the redevelopment to uh, the community. But what happened is it stopped right at Crawford Square. Okay, none of that money never came up the street. It went downtown, the US Steel Building and all the redevelopment downtown. Uh, um, the point, building the point up and things of that nature. So when we look at the smoke screen and the disingenuous nature of any uh, urban redevelopment plan, okay, it never works for the people they say it's going to work for. Um, we have the best education system in the world at Pitt University, Carnegie Mellon, Duquesne, and the surrounding areas. I can't go. So you understand what I'm saying? People come from all over the world. The greatest hospital in the world is right here in Pittsburgh. But how do I get access to that? You take the, the Vietnamese community. The members say their economic dollar stays in their community 17 times. You take the Jewish community. That dollar stays in their community 12, 13 times. You take the average white American community. The dollar stays in the community seven to eight times. But in the black community across America, the dollar stays in the community minus 67%. That means 67 cent at every dollar never makes it to the community. How can they, how can they be prosperous? How can they grow? How can they have energy? How can they have hope when they're leaving their money someplace else? We were nervous and whatnot and, and we didn't get the promises from the 50s that came. So they put a smoke screen in civil rights and they, they covered in civil rights, but there's never been civil rights. You know, we have the same issues today economically, uh, access to capital, uh, redlining, access to all the things that we fought for in the uh, 1900s, the fight is still the same today. Okay, and so that illusion of inclusion is where the frustration comes from. I don't care how many degrees we get, how wealthy we become, you still are not included. And I'm saying included into the future plans. What I try to share with other minorities and whatnot, Go downtown and look at the planning commission, okay? They got a plan for you going out 100 years, and we're still stuck talking about civil rights in the past.